Jesse in the EVS showroom. I'm here to show you the Cineroid LED light. Just came out, probably, in my opinion, one of the most solid built, well-designed LED lights I've seen in a long, long time. They supply you with one battery and a shoe mount for mounting options. This sucker's bright. It has a full-out digital display for your dimming. It's powered on here. So here's without and with the LED light. It's a powerful light for the size. It'll last probably about three hours on a battery this size. If you get a big Sony battery, like the MPF 970s you'd use on the Z1U, Z7U, cameras like that, you're probably looking more about five hours, six hours. Something very interesting I thought about this light was the way they designed the LED panels. Now, it's a big trend right now in the industry to have very colored LED on camera lights where you can actually dial in outdoor, indoor, and they'll have two sets of lights. What Cineroid did was they gave you 96 extremely high quality LED super bright lights on the panel, and they give you both an outdoor and an indoor panel, and that's how you change your color temperature. To do so, it's not that hard at all. There's snaps on both sides. You just slide it down, comes off, attach your other color, pop it on, and you have indoor. Again, we're in mixed lighting, but this is how bright the light is. With, without. Something else they provide you with with the light is a grid, hooks on magnetically. What this does is it'll spot the light more and stop from spill on the sides. At 560, this is probably one of the best bang for buck on camera lights on the market today. The fact that it does both indoor and outdoor color is a huge advantage to other lights that don't. And they also give you the battery and charger, which typically would be about a $200 startup cost for any light if you didn't already have batteries. Thanks for watching.